The state minister of works, Mosai Chweru, has asked the people who are encroaching on the East African Civil Aviation Academy land to leave. Because as we bring in new courses, as we bring in so many other things to expand the possibilities in that school, we will need land, we will need to expand the runway, we will need to do so many things. But some people have encroached on the land. The Soroti city mayor, Joshua Edogu, denies the allegations that the city allocated the land to developers. We have never granted. Let there be proof. If we have granted somebody to construct on such land, we shall be held liable. But as far as I'm concerned, we are very sensitive. We, want, we don't want to interfere with the government's work. That's a very important facility to us, the ITESO. He called for a meeting between the Civil Aviation Authority and the city technical team to draw the boundaries before evictions are enforced. We have got a, a fully fledged uh, 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 committee that handles issues to do with the physical planning, issues to do with the survey, issues to do with the, with the granting permission, issues to do with all that's required, a fully fledged and we have got technical people. We have even our surveyor, they can work with their surveyor, then we get to know where is this encroachment. The Soroti City East Mayor Paul Omer says that continuously watching development taking shape on the flying school's land is responsible of civil aviation management. And there's a lot of huge investments that people are putting in that land. And of course above all is that you cannot look at people occupying land that is belonging to you as an institution and you are keeping quiet and people are continuously investing. Remember these are rural areas. The school management says the development around the airfield has hindered their operations. One must on the approach path, runway 05, which is our main runway, and that mass is really so high that a, a pilot coming to land is uh, cannot maintain his descent profile uh, as required. So you find that the pilot is forced to be higher than expected during the first, uh, final phase to land.